What is up guys? Welcome back to M3 Wood. We got a banger coming for you today. This is episode one of King of the Course. I'm walking up to the first tee. It'll actually be T10 because we're gonna end up playing the back uh, for this video. I got behind me rolling up right now. I got Puma and Abe with me. What's up guys? We're doing great. We just had some fajitas for, for lunch. Well, you did. I did. What'd you Abe guys did. have? Some, some fish sticks. Yeah. We had some fish sticks. Now, I remember last time I was eating fish sticks, I was a sailor at sea and I was on the Titanic. Wait, what? Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, so you can see Puma's in prime form, but what we're going to do for King of the Course is we are going to have two of us will play against each other hole one. If you win, you stay. If you lose, you switch out with the third guy. The winner of the video is whoever is King come hole nine so holes one two three four five six seven eight those are all just for bragging rights okay hole nine if you are king there and you win that hole you're king of the course you're the winner of the video so the first thing that we need to do is we need to figure out who is going to be playing for this video i'm going to be playing from the tips which is the blues puma will be playing from the whites and abe will be playing from his tee box at 150. All right, so first thing we need to do, gentlemen, yeah. is we need to figure out who's going to be playing and battling come hole one. Can we all three do that from hole one? We cannot. We have to, only two of us can be battling. You know, it's like one on one on the court. Uh -huh. You know, I so, I so. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So, Abe, come stand up here, right over here. Okay. Go ahead and flip a tee, Puma, since you're holding them. Ready? Yep. Whoever's pointing to is out. I don't know. What, do you know how to flip tees? You're kidding, right? <laughs> you know, that's not how you flip a T. Abe, flip a T for us. Whoever Vegas. points to is out. In Las Vegas. Abe, right. that's you. So you're out for hole one. So that means it's me and the big dog. Well, or should I, I say big cat? When I was in uh, dealing blackjack in Vegas, in the Bellagio, I'd flip a coin, I'd flip a T, I'd flip my mind out. I'd flip my mind out. Hopefully you wouldn't flip anyone off. Abe, who do you think is going to win this first hole? Uh, you point to me? To me? Yeah. You know it, baby. Um, Puma just puts it right down the middle. Straight out the car, right down the middle. Um, there are moments in my life where I feel like God kisses me. Not on the forehead, not on the cheeks, not on the lips. He blesses me. He hit it a little to the right, kind of a pull job, down there by the dirt slops. All ground under repair. What's that mean? Let's go. Let's do it. Oh, Puma, did you just ask what ground under repair means? I did. What's that mean when you say that? All right, so when it's ground under repair, you, you see it marked. It. You can, wherever you are, you usually pull it out of that. Sometimes it's flight. Sometimes it's behind. Uh -huh. uh, on this case, at our course right now, we're having some groundwork done, yeah. and it is played lateral. So sure. wherever my ball is, it's pulled out lateral gotcha. as a free drop. All right, Puma, it's yeah. not a bad shot, right dead center in the middle. Not too bad. Unfortunately, you found the broken fairway part. A little split fairway action. Yeah. But it shouldn't really matter. Folks, I want you to do one thing for me. If you would just take a look at my shoes. Mm. I got some new ones. You know, I'm Views. normally a sandal wearer. But I think I'm, they know that. I'm moving into the uh, Kizik's. Okay. These are Kizik's. Not sponsored I'll yet. I'll demonstrate later what that means. Yeah, not, 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 not sponsored yet. Let's go to the hole. <laughs> I can't move it. Got to put it down. That's right. So. Pins at the back. You got about 90 yards. All right. This feels like the one I hit, I hit it over at the, the bear. Over Muirfield. Hey, do you really remember that story, huh? 
It was hard because I'd come off a concussion that day. Oh. oh. I was at Kings Island. Flared that one out to the right. That's not going to be a fun shot for you because you're sun tanning. <laughs> <laughs> That's a knee slapper. Thank you, Abe. Thank you. There There's his lie. He's got to go over the sand a little bit. He's probably about 70 yards out. Maybe less. Here's his shot. Big hitter. He made sure he got over looks like he went over just a smidge. He might be able to chip. There just might even be some. Up there, I was afraid of that sand. I didn't want to join you. All right, Puma. Question Walk for the listeners. Oh, yeah. What's your favorite, Kings Island or Cedar Point? Hmm, yours? I think Cedar Point, mostly because it's got some vicious rides. Yeah. And the snow cones are better. Oh, big snow cone guy. Pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> So here we go, up to the bunkers. This ought to get interesting. I got this thing here. That's the, shouldn't go in here really, that's the big play, is to not hit it here. That is correct. But, uh, this is where many golfers might complain about it. Not me. Not you, you're not a complainer. Not a big time complainer. No. Yeah, I shouldn't have gone here. <laughs> No, you definitely shouldn't have. Not from like 90 yards out. Right. Not the play. Hey, you're out. That's actually a pretty good shot with what you were looking at. I, I had some <laughs> carnage in front of me. You did, but you still managed to work it. I think I took the carnage away. Good shot. <laughs> Thank good you. Good shot. That was probably for him a miscue. That was not good. Okay. Not good. Get there. Oh. Got some hair on the dog. Oh my gosh. Load up. Hit it. All right. We got a couple. Couple knee knockers. Yeah. Now we haven't decided what happens if we tie. Good bogey. Thank you. Shot. So the big hitter and I both get a bogey. Alright, so that is two bogeys for Puma and I, and we were the ones battling for the hole. So what we're gonna do to decide who is king of this hole and gets to continue on and play against Abe is we are gonna pick a putt and play closest to. So I think what we're gonna do is we'll just go down maybe to about 20, 30 feet right below the hole and okay. see who gets closest. Let's check it out. Well, that's Puma's putt. Not good. Let's go. Got him, purple shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real nice. All right. Looks like I got Abe on hole two. Okay. That was a pretty atrocious finish to the hole. A uh, couple bogeys taken, and then I ended up taken the closest two. Uh, Puma did not put his very close, so it was not difficult for me to put that closest. And looks like I get to face the little guy. All right, Abe. It's me and you, boy. Me and you come hold two. It's a long walk back to where I got to tee off, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not that worried, though. Oh, you're not that worried, huh? All right, well, see if I can't put some out there and put a little fear in you. Left. I'm going to shivery. Oh, oh, shivery. Hey, at least I think you have to hit your drive before I hit my second shot. I'll take that. Thank you. Thank you. 
All right, we got Abe here, hole two, seeing if he can't dethrone me. I'm a little bit off to the right. So here's his tee shot. He's got to put some pressure on. Oh, wow. oh got under it, so it's going to stay dead straight. I definitely ain't shivering, but you will still be about 80 yards out. Yeah, that's a good part of being at 150. That is a good part of being at 150. <laughs> Take advantage. Here is man in purple shirt. I don't really know what to call you. Oh, that's a good shot. Punchy. Yeah. Good shot. Great shot, up. Short. Just short. I'll take it all day. See if I can't work something short. That's a great ball. Run up now. Oh! Took a nasty bounce. A nasty bounce. That was a good ball, good play. Because in this hole, you want to be short to bring out. Because if you guys remember, as we walk up here, there is, a, this is a peninsula green almost. There's water to the left and water to the right. Uh, so you definitely want to give yourself a chance to get up, maybe with like a link style shot, roll it up, uh, but also bring the damage out of play. All right, so over here now we have, I am just short. Abe's ball was nearly perfect, just took a brutal bounce. So now you're in the thick stuff. You're going with a wedge. And he's got about, he's got some green to work with. Going back and forth, gonna stay with the wedge. Commit to your shot. Beauty, beauty. You talk about putting the pressure on me, son. That's a great shot. You shivering in your great boots. shot. Break down. Ah, didn't break like I thought it would, but I should be able to make that for par. Ooh, you threw the whole left side of the cup there. Nice shot. The whole left side. So I'm assuming this is good then, Abe, yeah? Nope. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. no. I will tell you this. When I make this, Abe, I'm one for one in the closest two playoffs. <laughs> but when you miss it, you're going to be dethroned. All right, Puma, you are the guy that's out. So you go ahead and pick the distance that we have to hit from. Get there. Oh, my. Let's see if I can't make it. All right, so we are walking off hole two. That was just an awful putting exhibition from you and I. I think we felt like the greens were gonna be much quicker than they actually were. Yeah. Either way, you survive, you're now king, and you're battling the Puma on okay. hole three. All right. It's almost like it was staged for all three of us to battle. To get a chance. All right, Puma, you're back in the battle ring. Uh, it's fitting, really, when you think about it. Sure. Because most things are cyclical. Uh -huh. They go in circles. Right. It's my time, my turn. To take, guess, take circle, the crown? Circle of life, as Elton John would say. For sure. Oh, Abe? Wait. Oh, walking by with the crown. Okay. <laughs> okay. Also, to be known, Puma, this is the last hole of this first episode. So, okay. one of you two will be the, the king of the course at the end of episode one. Okay. Does that mean anything? To me, it means a lot. No, it means nothing. Oh, dead straight, no turn on it. Oh, it took a really good bounce back into the fairway off of something. I'll take it. You pray hard today? I pray at three in the morning till about six, and then I go to sleep for 45 minutes, and then I pray some more, not just for me, but for the world. Well, you got a prayer's bounce there, that's for sure. That's what I prayed for. <laughs> yeah. Abe, I'll tell you this, this pains me to be holding this camera filming you instead of me being there, but I got nothing to blame but my weak putting stroke. So you are the king now on hole three battling Puma. And the irony of why the cart is so close to you, 
I do not know. Maybe it's a mind game from Puma. Maybe he can get in there and move it a little bit since you are going to be swinging or not. Nope. All right. He's going for it. Puma with a mind game. Abe hits a pretty good ball, just pulls it to the left. Uh, there is some construction up there, so we'll see if you're going under repair. You might be just short of it. Now, the reason why the car was so close is because Puma was actually very close. So now we have Puma just ahead of the 150 stake. See if he can't put something on and put some pressure on the little man. Nope, okay. Folks. He got something for him? I've always thought that the perfect shot is yeah. not always closest to the hole. Sure. It's the one that you hit that wins. Oh, some say it's the next shot. I don't say that. Oh, you don't say that. Because <laughs> there will be no next shot. This one's going in, right? Johnny Night Train. Johnny Night Train. Oh, got up underneath it, going up real high to the right. It's going to be a bit short. It'll be really short. You just kind of like flew it up there. You used a wedge? Did you really? Did you really use a wedge? <laughs> No, you didn't. You just lied to our viewers. I used an eight wedge. Anybody who's Team Puma, he just lied to you. You hit a good shot. You're just off to the left. See if you can't throw something up on the green. Work that wedge game again. Yeah, you just got to really commit to getting it up there. Get up. Get up. Oh, that's a great ball. You're going to be right below the hole. Atta boy. Got a nice little putt of bird. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I felt like after you hit it, you weren't too pleased. Didn't get enough of it at first, you thought? Yeah. Yeah, and no, then it kind of... It stopped short. Yeah, it stopped right where you wanted it. Yeah. All right, put some pressure on this guy. That's a great shot, Abe. Young stallion. You might need to get something tight because he's now putting for bird. Yeah. Come on, I've, Puma. Uh, I've thought about it, and I think if I had my ruthers... Your ruthers? My, my Johnny Carruthers. Johnny, okay, all right. I would rather get close than far away. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that means, but... <laughs> I'm hoping some of our viewers do. <laughs> oh, get up. Get up. Abe walks in like it's not a big deal at all. <laughs> Oh, get in. Great putt. Comfy par. Put the pressure on Puma. Comfy par. All right, Puma. This is make or Abe is king. Starting episode two. Oh, it did. I was going to say all three holes in episode one would have ended with a nice little playoff. Instead, you're the king to end episode one. Feel good? Yes. Heck yeah. Good job, babe. Heck yeah. All right, folks. So that is the end of episode one. Uh, remember, we drop videos every Sunday and Wednesday, seven o'clock. So be sure to come and check out how episode two goes for king of the course. Abe is king. I'm up starting hole one on episode two. Plan on taking that crown from him. Don't forget to smash the like button. Don't forget to share with a friend. And as always, hey, hey, hey. check you later. It looks like he's he's got a pretty decent shot. He's got to get over some sand. Did not get a good, did not get a good drop, though. Nope. Am I well, doing... The, the beauty of Puma filming right okay, there. Okay, there we go. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> now we'll take a good look. There we go.